Hi everybody, it's Trish. I'm out here today at Okahili to talk to you about something we all learned in school. And in my case, years ago. Okay? So, we learned about a guy who was pretty famous. His name was Sir Isaac Newton. And he had some laws. He had some, he had some laws about physics. Okay? And one of those laws was for every action, there is an opposite and equal reaction. So, let's take an example. If I want to say jump, okay, I have to push downward with my feet and legs to propel myself upward. So depending on how much force I put down will give me how high I will jump, okay? That is an opposite and equal reaction. In golf, we swing the club, and don't forget, what's the definition of swing? The definition of swing is a backward forward motion from a fixed point, okay, or to and fro motion. So if I swing the club back this far, it will what? Go forward that far. Do you see that? So in golf, for every action, there's an opposite and equal reaction. So when I set up in that balanced position and I start the club with my hands and I swing the club to my right shoulder as a right-handed player, I must then therefore swing the club to my left shoulder, okay? So if I've swung the club to my right shoulder, I must then swing it to my left shoulder. If I swing the club to the toe up position, the club will go to the toe up position on the opposite side. Because for every action, there is an opposite and equal reaction. I can't tell you how many times on the lesson tee that I see, you know, Mr. Jones or Mrs. Jones take the club all the way back here and then slam it into the ground. And they either hit the top of the ball or chunk it three inches, four inches behind the ball because they're trying to hit the ball. If we change our mindset and we think about swing the club, then Sir Isaac Newton's laws of physics come into play. For every action, there's an opposite and equal reaction. Okay? So we swing the club backward, we must then swing it forward. Okay? Backward and forward. Or I should say backward forward. Remember, for however much effort you put going back, that same effort, opposite and equal, must be put forward. When we jump, we push down on the ground to go up in the air. We swing the club back to allow it to swing the club forward. Hopefully this makes sense. Come see me at Okahili or at Park Ridge. Golf Professional Services and myself are here to help you make your golf game better. And don't forget, like and subscribe to this page for more great tips and tricks to help you improve your game. Until next week, have a great week.